friends, subscribers, internet strangers, welcome to Monday Mornings, what the hell the Bigger Picker sold this week video. So, this week was kind of a slow week, um, probably my effort in listing did not help either. Um, I'm embarrassed myself for how little I listed, but that's alright, we're going to fix that today. We're going to have a strong listing week this week. Uh, let's see, I sold 62 items, and these are the over 20s or the interesting ones that have a story or a lesson. So, without further ado, let's switch screen, switch, switch scenes. All right. Wouldn't be the Bearded Picker Show without a VCR. This is a sharp, uh, it's a forehead VCR with the remote. I hope they don't want my TV. Uh, man, I've really got to look at these pictures. Some of them, I've put some blurry pictures up. <clears throat> anyway, excuse me. Got 3795 plus 11 shipping for that guy. I think I actually took an offer on this one of 35 so somebody saved $2.95. All right, next up, a TI-83 Plus calculator, uh, $37.95 with, with $3.95 shipping, so that's a good one. Actually so, actually sold, it's not in the video, I don't know why it didn't show up, but I sold the uh, I sold the TI-84 Plus, the one that I picked up at the... At the Flea market for a dollar. Old fella said that he found it underneath the car, underneath the seat of an old junk car. He'd take a dollar for it. Yeah, that was awesome. This adhesive stick spray. I've got two dollars in it from a drugstore clearance. I actually sold two of them. They were not on sale, so I got uh, eighteen dollars for these two shipped. I just thought that stuff was kind of weird, so that's why I was like, "Hey, look at that stuff." I actually got one two I got five of these to ship out today uh, they're they're on sale again well that sucks I've been selling them at $21 oh well I don't care they need to go away <laughs> I've still got another box of these things I've still got like it says three available it's more like 13 this was a good sale here from the $10 Dreamcast lot Thirty-seven ninety-five for a uh, record of Lotus War. I don't know what's so special about it, other than it makes money. <laughs> this is a good one here. Uh, it was actually the twenty dollars and ninety-nine cent. It wasn't on sale. Um, Wade uh, on Wade's Ventures when I did an interview with him a, what, a week and a half ago. Um, this is one of the items I showed, you know, he's like, show five items that people can find uh, just to look up. I'm like, this exact one, I'm like, this thing is going to sell fast. Uh, it has got the skip protection. It is in really nice condition. And it did. <laughs> and it's just sitting over on the table. It's ready. I got to box it up. Uh, the ring here, I think for some hat, I got this on here twice, but... Anyway, if we do, we'll say hello to it again. Twenty-seven ninety-five for this game, and it's it's sitting over there to be shipped as well. So, um, but you can see the crack in the case right there. I I got those two free cases at the yard sales this weekend in the free box, and I changed the case out, so it's no longer cracked. Robotech Invasion, um, twenty bucks. He's gone. Another one of these Motorola phones. I've got, I think, four more. $50 shipped. If you recognize these, that means you watch Lonnie's videos. This is a pair of Sony headphones. MDR W014. I actually, that's a... Uh, that's Lonnie's title. <laughs> I copied Lonnie's listen and told him about it. Um, I got $25 for this one. Just a pair of headphones. Nothing else. Just headphones. They're, they're, they sound nice. They're in really nice shape. Um, their original headphones were some sort of Walkman. I'm much, I bet I got them with a tape player and they were broken. But they're very. I think what people like about them is they're so lightweight and they don't need uh, they don't need foam on them. They have that plastic. Oh, no. That was a good sale. This camera here, 44.95. 
It is a cannon. Man, why are my pictures blurry? Some are really, really nice, like that one with a small detail, then others. But these, this is why I pick up cameras all the time. If, if it's got more than 10 megapixels on it, you need to check it. That's, uh, that's the line of demarcation. <laughs> that's the line. That's, that's the area I find where if it's if it's 10 or more megapixels right now, you can usually make good money on it. 1595 was special about the Sony cards. I sold five of them, so that was five times 16. That was that was a nice number. Dino Crisis, another 29 plus three. I don't know, I don't know why I put shipping on this one, but I didn't put shipping on the rest of them. <laughs> oh well. Pair of bedroom slippers. They were 19.99. They're still new with the tags. I can't believe we took a picture with a 12.99. Still on it. Oops. I got those for a uh, dollar 29 cents on uh, Walgreens. 90% Halloween clearance. Polaroid. It went to 27.95. It went to retrospect. This Nerf gun, I don't know where I picked it up. I, I know I paid full retail for it. It wasn't. It's one that I, I, I have sold a lot of this on Amazon. It was just laying around. Jacob actually listed it, so we made a few dollars on it. Thirty-three dollars on the gun. I think I've got twelve dollars in it. Water defense. These are the guys that I went all the way to St. Louis to pick up. I've got. I had 232 of them. Um, somebody bought eight of these. That was $216. That was a that was a nice sale. This is the last of the Polaroids that I'm going to show you. Um, I sold five of them this week, the first one, and then I picked this one because it was different. Um, some kind of talking. I don't know. I pick up any Polaroid camera that's a 600 because that's those are the ones generally that Retrospect would pick up. So any any 600 Polaroid I pick up. 600, they use a 600 film, I'm sorry, not a 6. And I believe it says it. Does it say it on there somewhere? No. Well, alrighty then. Moving right along. This was in a video from the yard sales. I picked it up for 20 bucks. And... I had a lot of offers, a lot of low balls, you know, a lot of 80s, a lot of 70s, a lot of 100s, and I just just waited and finally got a full price offer. It was 138 plus 11 to ship it, so that and that was a big box. I, it cost like 24 dollars to ship that thing. The Unreal Tournament, not to be confused with the real tournament. 15.95 on so that was a nice week on the I sold three of the games this week that was nice still got uh, probably 20 left this one here the Space Invaders uh, it's like a little arcade looking game where's a good picture of it anyway uh, I I believe it plugs into your TV the the guy sent a note saying that he had wore his out and uh, it was nice to find another one it was brand new so he can start playing again. Hey, I'm here to I'm here to please. If you're looking for it, I'll go find it. If you're paying cash money, I'll go find it. Uh, shareable sheep. Uh, people ask, can you sell the Walgreens stuff on on eBay? Probably. This was laid on the counter, and Jacob was looking for stuff to list, so he listed it before I could uh, send it to Amazon, and I got. Or I have three dollars and eighty-nine cents plus tax in this thing, so eighteen ninety-nine. Did I get any shipping? No. These guys here I've had for quite a while. Um, they are some kind of pants by Champion, thermal pants. The person bought two of them, so. It's this, it says check my date. I had $3.99 in these things. Um, this is the old way that... Well, I can never... Bargain Hunt used to do their price tags as as the date would go farther away. Um, 
that's the date they checked it in or they put it on the on the floor you know say say i bought them in october 10 you know they there's a chart in there that that's, it's a percentage off of the price the longer they stay and so i got 14.99 they weren't on sale then uh for two pairs so it was almost 30 dollars for two pairs And it wouldn't be the bearded picker without having a, a flip phone. Twenty three ninety five on this little joker. Uh, it was a nice little phone, very compact. It was one of the later ones because it didn't have it. Some of them have the antennas that stick out the end that just, this is one of the better ones. Samsung's, Motorola's generally had antennas hanging out of them. Samsung's had internal antennas, which is nice. Um, can anyone guess what the last item is? I know you can probably read it up there, but, oh no. You can't read it. It's cut off. The next item. What does a bald man really need? Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> Some hair dye. I had six dollars on that. Got twenty-six dollars. So this was a short video for a soul video. Um, I hope that continues. To, I'll, keep, I'll keep doing this as long as people watch them. Um, I hope it gives you ideas on you know what you can pick up, what you can sell. Um, Hopefully next week it'll be much, much longer because I will have sold a bunch more since I didn't start listing very much yesterday. Today is a good day to start listing. Just because you have not done it yesterday doesn't mean today is a failure. Take advantage of your opportunities today. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to list 30, no doubt about it. Only thing I have left to do is shipping and then listing for the rest of the day. Alrighty. If you have any questions, uh, leave them in the comments below. Um, have you sold any of this kind of stuff? Did you learn anything? Let me know. I, I, I like hearing from you guys. And uh, thanks for doing the YouTube stuff. Smash. I mean, break your computer or your phone to hit the like button. <laughs> that just doesn't make any sense to me. All right. Uh, I just got a couple words of wisdom for you. Roll Tide.